Okay, so a little update on the bone scope feature idea. Um, we have a script from a user. Uh, the excellent Synthesin 75 has made uh, a script for this that works pretty well already. Um, it's not ready to be released into the wild just yet, but here's a little look at how it works. Okay. So here we have the button. It works just as the tool works, just like the old um, transform tool, but it has added to it the scope. So here we have the normal view of the bones as it's uh, as with them all turned on. It's a little bit messy and noisy, a lot of stuff to look at. Um, and here we have it with the scope with its uh, sensitivity turned on. So as you see, as I drag over, I can select any bone that I want. Uh, there's a few things to be added to how this works, but um, as you see, the timeline is clear at the moment. But if I was to select this red target, you'll see that all the red bones are selected. If I was to go to here and select uh, the orange target, then you see all the orange um, keys are right down here so you can see the grey uh, are targeted too, uh, are keyed as well. So but basically that's it. Uh, I think there could be a little bit um, more be uh, done to it just because of the way that the uh, timeline interacts with it but essentially this is this is how it works you know you want to move uh, look for a bone you find it you move it you know and uh, otherwise and then it stays active so you can see all the keys for that particular bone um, anyway that's the basic idea and um, I'll let you know how it goes